I've decided that I probably will, should do the top stitching as per the pattern, so it might look better. So I'm going to do the top stitching down the centre panel, pushing all the seam towards the centre back. Uh, sorry, to, yeah, towards the centre back, the centre of the hood. So this is the hood here, and I'm just sewing right down the centre. I'm using the edge of the um, foot here, so I changed to a wider foot in case you haven't noticed, which will make it easier to um, have it even all the way along. I've got the machine settings on um, stitch length at about a three. Anybody's wondering, I'm sewing on a semi industrial um, banana that's probably, I don't know, about 40 years old, roughly. I think it's a more professional finish when you put the top stitch in there. twist underneath because it's starting to go like that underneath so I've got to make sure that I'm pushing it both seams towards the, towards the centre back panel or the centre um, hood piece Exactly the same thing, pushing it towards the centre on the, the centre panel, hood panel, and the lining. The pattern's really made for a stretch, but I decided to use a, um, a contrast fabric that I've already got. But because it's a hood, it's probably not a biggie because it's not something that I need the stretch for. I can feel through there the two thicknesses. Feel right. And so I'm just going to continue with this on the other side as well. Exactly the same. Six and six A we're going to do now. Basically putting the two pieces together. So I've pinned right across the, the part of the hoodie over the front where your head goes. This is where your head would be. Your face, should I say, would be. Again, 1.5 centimeters seam. lined up the, the centre of the hood at the top. I'm using a ballpoint needle, a knitted a needle suitable for knit. Don't want to be poking holes in the fabric as you're sewing it. 